What's up guys? So in the previous two videos, we were looking at uh, the new best slow units. We had Mr. Wax and we had Katakuri. Um, however, there is a unit that is a seven star and it is a slow. And he kind of lost his spot now, unfortunately, thanks to uh, the buff making Katakuri a hybrid unit. So we're going to be taking a look at, I guess, the new worst slow unit. All right, obviously, like, the one that's viable. I'm not counting at those four-star slow units. Like, let's be real, guys. So we're going to be taking a new a look at the new worst slow unit because if we take a look at the Discord announcements, he got a buff. All right, so here is where he announced it. So it is announced all the way oh, up here in an update. So here we go, guys. So new buff on Falcon 7-star. Well, let's take a look at what it is. All right, so we're going to have him equipped, and then we're going to have, uh, let's see here. We're going to have, who else needs equipped? Um, we need to bring our boy Katakuri, and we're going to bring the other slow unit, Wax Slow, as well. And actually, we'll just bring Katakuri, because no, the other Wax Slow guy isn't really that good um, after Katakuri's buff. So uh, let's go bring him, and let's get rid of his orb, because it's going to kind of, you know, skew the results a little bit. And I guess we technically have another slow unit here. He's a slow unit, but like with a 26 cooldown, you know, who really cares? So uh, let's go see what this guy's buff is looking like. And let's go see if the, his buff is enough to make him a viable slow unit again. Here we go. All right, let's get it started. So let's go uh, see what we're comparing it with. So let's go get our boy Mochi all the way upgraded. He's now whack slow though. And this guy is still slow. So uh, we're going to be seeing which one you want to bring so i believe this guy supposedly got a mainly a damage buff so maybe he's gonna be good because he's doing a lot of damage and he's still the og slow and he does hit air so let's go see what this guy's buff is hitting with so let's get him some upgrades here and i guess we'll show off his effects as well while we're at it um i don't know you guys want to still get him i believe he is actually still in the he's in the new banner right the new stardust banner with uh Madara. so i know a lot of people will now have him so good thing he got a buff 188k damage all right not gonna lie his damage is pretty decent so uh, we have him all the way up at uh wow dang okay so it looks like he got some extra upgrades now so he has standby all the way down here so uh, this allows you to interval with him which makes him pretty decent for leaderboards etc 450 971 then 14 million damage with a 9 SPA. And remember, he does have that ace placement. So uh, that's not bad at all. So uh, roughly 14 million times 4. Roughly 50 million DPS. Which is actually crazy. So the thing about him is. He now has almost meta damage. Alright. Unfortunately, I did not bring my buff unit with me in the, for this video. Which is a big L. But um, he now has meta damage. As well as being a slow unit and hitting airs. Now, the one thing that's worse about him is he does not have Wax Slow. So, it depends, I guess, how much you value Wax Slow versus this guy's normal slow. But, uh, as far as damage is concerned, you want to bring him because uh, his damage is insane and puts him pretty much up there on the meta damaging list. Now, obviously, he's no Gilgamesh, but he's actually surprisingly close to Gilgamesh. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, uh, hey, maybe you guys want to try bringing this guy on your infinite mode teams. Um, he might be worth it.